Hello YouTube, uh, well, welcome back to the long haul, day 66 of this, uh, whatever episode it is at this point, um, did, been doing some combining overnight and got another screamer, come here screamer, it's almost daytime, thought I'd just start you guys off with the screamer, I'm sure there's probably going to be more sh trouble showing up, did some nail gun merging, you know, just kind of merge the parts up, uh, See you later, Penny. And Charlie's done. And there's Charlie's twin brother. And oh, there you are. Uh, and I did some more. I did some AK part merging. You know, got a 546 stock, 493 receiver, and a 347 uh, barrel. But one thing that's really cool is, uh, while overnight, you know, get away from the base. Sorry, just making sure they're taken care of. But, uh, maxed out the, uh, the actual, like, internals for the 44 Magnum. There's another screamer showing up. Yep, more company. Take care of you. And joy, just what I need more of more company. Oh, hi, Spider. Come here. There we go. But what? That's not all. I realized I have enough parts for the rocket launcher. It's not fully repaired because I don't have that many parts for it. But hey, even a cop showed up. We'll take care of him in just a second. I really wish he didn't spit on my darn base. Well, actually, just pop him. If I actually remember to load the Magnum, but... Here, full of the assembled rocket launcher. Okay. Let's give it a... Did not mean to shoot the base, but... Eh, sacrifices have to be made. Are you serious? Uh, a couple steel arrows. Usually the cops are better at loot. That was heck, I was kind of hoping maybe for a shotgun, like a fully assembled shotgun, but eh, beggars can't be choosers. Okay, because I'm actually getting us pretty close on having my shotgun is actually fully maxed out except for the barrel. That is a critical component to that, and. You're actually looking pretty good, and I just realized I had like a whole bunch of repair kits just sitting there. And, uh, but, you know, thanks to the, the sawed off shotgun, uh, well, to the shotgun receiver being maxed out, I can actually, I've actually started to have, uh, you know, kind of have more of a fully assembled sawed off. So, and then, you know, because I have a maxed out pump, I can actually start giving parts to that too, but. Sniper rifle uh, has gone up a little bit to 528, and the pistol grip's really what we need on the pistol to max that out. I was working on uh, trying to get some more um, parts, you know, merged for the hunting rifle, you know, anything aside from the hunting rifle parts, you know, because I know that stuff is maxed out. We'll just grab the. Would you look at that? The hunting rifle parts. Of course, made more steel overnight. I'm actually running low on iron material, but I just wanted to check out what if there was any more hunting rifle stuff. No. But we can at least see what... Yeah, there's a crawler down here. Take him back. There you go. Take care of him really quick, but... You know, we're getting there. We are getting there. I, I'm pretty sure I won't have, uh, you know, fully maxed out stuff on on the weapons before day 70, but it's like, wherever, wherever I end it, it's okay. Because you never know, I might actually come back and visit this once in a while. I might hurt our zombie beating on stuff, but we're up to level 503. Grabbing some of the kind of non-assembled handguns and everything like that just to... Because I feel it's actually 
I haven't checked out Trader React yet. Or local Trader React. Yeah. Well, I can call him Trader React. But, uh, you know, figured might as well just go over. Oh, another pistol grip. Grab that. Sorry, just. Just trying to focus on. You know, I just want to kind of get that max out, but. Figure we'll go take a trip over, so. We'll check out what our pistol grip goes up to now. It's a 531 currently. And, uh. A 542, so. Nice to see, so we're gonna go over to Trey Rect. I will see you in just a moment. Well, folks, here we are at Trader X. Here we are. Happy, happy to see old Trader X here. Um, you know, just hopefully, uh, especially if he has something decent for me. Trader X, do you have anything useful, or are you just gonna be, are you just gonna be the same old, same old pathetic in this? Hi, Trader X. Everything's for sale, even to an idiot like you. Okay, okay, don't calm it down there. Just want to see if you got anything good to sell, like you can sell me. I, I'll still sell it and sell to Trader X. It's just that I just want to see what he's got in stock. AK-47 stock, unfortunately, he does not have what I'm exactly looking for there. He's got decent stock, and well, he's getting, he's got decent stuff there. He unfortunately doesn't have all what I need, but it's like if that was the AK-47 parts, I would have bought that really quick. Uh, we'll keep the flashlight, but um, you know what? Well, at least just sell him some stuff. Like uh, all the extra gun parts I get, it's like. I'm just gonna sell those because, like, I'm not. I can't really improve my weapons further. We'll even sell that partial shotgun off because the stock and receiver are already maxed out. Got 11,000 coin. Um, if I had the money, I would probably would have bought the SMG you know, just to merge some stuff. Like, but and no, and no dice, unfortunately. Um. Yeah, you really don't got much. Well, actually, take that, take that pistol grip off you, because I will take it for an extra little bit of my, little bit of my uh, merging stuff. And um, yeah, really. All right, now that we're done doing business, get out of my store. Okay, Trey wrecked. But uh, as I was gonna say though, yeah, like. We'll just save the coin just in case he has, uh, just in case he's got the, you know, the pieces to the AK. Um, levels are so slow, so I wonder, like, oh, my max? No. I almost want to just pump some points into, into better barter if I get enough over the next few days just to, he's actually going to restock tomorrow, but, you know, just see if uh, I can find... Just to see if I could possibly get the last AK piece off him. It's like... But, you know, probably not going to. It's like, the there's two more restocks after today. It's going to be... It's going to be, you know, tomorrow, and then day 70 will be the... You know, which... Being the, that'll be the, the last... Uh, not only the last episode, but also the last... Um, trade restock uh, day of this world, so if we're fortunate enough, we might find it, but I don't have too much I don't have too much uh, hopes up for that. Got a couple of locals here. If I just so happen to get the uh, get enough off the zombies, you know, to have you know, just have enough on the uh, the uh, the good old uh, skill points side, I might. Well, then again, I'd have to take out so many zombies it wouldn't even be funny just to get the just get the uh, 
get the uh, skills up, so. Unfortunately, probably won't get a full AK in this world. On co-op, at least, I do I do have a full AK-47. I at least have I at least have one on there that I can enjoy and it's not too bad, so. Okay. I didn't, we'll just take more take some more steel here and just see what we get. There we go. We'll just and we'll just kind of work on making more steel up. Oh. Got to be careful with the hatches here. Uh, we'll have to get, uh, grab the concrete really quick just to have, just to check that out, you know, just get a, get a little, just see how much, uh, progress we can actually get towards the, uh, good old, uh, good old second level steel. Um, there we go, get you upgraded, and... And okay, so we're so we at least have a we've at least gotten about halfway around the our the other portion the second portion. Uh, this will probably be the you know, considering like you know, and coming and everything you know probably be the the last of the steel upgrades for the uh, for the for the for the base. You know, I do have some. Some basic, uh, you know, some basic, uh, some basic improvements I want to do on the on the base here, and and I think I'm actually gonna time lapse that for those of you on YouTube. You know, just it's not gonna take too long. It's just basic, you know, just some basic improvements like spider protection and and all that. It's just gonna be. It's going to require a little bit of concrete, but we're not going to... It's not going to be too crazy. It's... So... I don't even think I'll do it out of concrete. I think I'll probably just do it on a... Uh, do it out of wood. Because, like, I don't think... I don't think the, the spider zombies will do that much damage, but... You just never know. Keep the forges happy. Um, well, you got some more ready to come out. We'll give. We'll just kind of make a. I'll just you know, just give a little bit more iron to and these. Try to get the last of this. Just the last of these upgrades done. Just one one second here. Let's just see our little. Status update here on the on the old uh, steel. Come here. And yep, we're so we already almost have the second layer of blocks done, but yeah. So let the time lapse commence and uh, should we should have this done fairly quickly. <laughs>
Well, YouTube interrupting the uh, time lapse really quick. I guess it's a a dog day, or there's a couple dogs hanging around here. Like I had some screamers show up. Uh, I don't think there's are the result of the screamer because usually screamers are what summon them fairly quick. Just trying to keep an eye out here. Yep, I see you. Come here. There we go, take care of him real quick and... Let's just have a look. We'll just take this big guy out. I was one to use wood... wood... Uh, wedges, yo. Yo, for this, just to... You. Yo, know, just to kind of give it more of a gradual uh, edge. But what I'm thinking about doing is, you know, throwing some plates on this just for if the game you know, considers a support. It sh I don't see why it wouldn't. But sometimes, like, yo, know, the physics can be a little bit weird on building. But you know, throwing some plates up top, yo, know, or like some sheets, just to. You. And, uh, you just have a little bit of a, you have this be my spider protection. Because, uh, I noticed that in the last Horde Night, you know, have, uh, had some dancing spiders on the, on the roof of my base. It's, uh, you know, it just gives a little bit, but this will hope, this, this should hopefully give me enough, uh, Keep it from, uh, you know, having a. Yo, keep them from climbing up. Like, usually it does a good job of it. Because, uh, spire zombies are able to. Or one of the f few zombies, uh, well, they're the only zombie in the game that can climb, can go up blocks uh, vertically. And, um, it's, so it's like, a spire protection's a thing, and I'll even, you know, I think, I think I'll even put ramps up just to, in the, on the, uh, insides of the walkways, too, just to be absolutely certain. I don't think they can climb up, uh, ladders like, uh, how I have them set up, but it's a little bit... Yo, this is one of those taking precautions, and I'm like, really, Spire Zombie shouldn't, shouldn't do much to the base, so, well, to, the, to these, it's like, that's why I'm only doing woods, like, I was a little tired of, in this series of, you know, just making, uh, concrete, and it's just one of those that's like, can never be too careful, and and, uh, okay, I just need some extra, some wood frame, you know, some of these wood frame ramps, you know, just, I'll do, like, 20 more of these. We'll just grab that, and, besides, it might, I think it'll even give a nicer aesthetic to the base, so, um, and we'll just grab that, and. As you can see, nice, just little minor upgrades, and that's not even it for you know, giving you know, upgrading the space just a little bit more. There's another modification I wanted to do here, which we'll cover in just a second after I'm done, uh, you know, upgrading, you know, just modifying the. You know, making these additions, and it's like, not worried about support at all. And, there we go. Have a... This nail gun makes it so easy. Even provide some construction tool XP. You know, and... I think that's all those done. Yep! Perfect.
perfecto mundo. And so next uh, next order of business here is look up some railings and I want to do some I want to do some railings on on top of the base here. Just kind of have a we'll do like forty of those because. Uh, you know, I have my ladders up to the top of the base on each side, you know, makes uh, for a, makes for a really, really nice aesthetic, you know, just kind of a, well, it's like, you know, but I remember one time I broke my, broke my, uh, broke my legs, uh, you know, accidentally climbing way too fast off the top of this, so I just want to do this really, you know, just kind of, you know, it also just kind of makes the base look a little bit better, but it, it, it makes it safe. And it's like, what, what, what can go wrong with having the base being a, you know, looking a little bit better and uh, safer at the same time? And one thing I'm also one to one to do is, you know, have another. We'll do another 24 because it took 32 railings, but, uh, you know, install some windows in the space, you know. Just kind of, just, just have this being, just looking nice, and we'll do, like, some lighting. You know, have a bit of base building episode, just, instead of, like, you know, just having, like, this extensive overhaul of, of, uh, blocks, you know, just, well, just the base, you know, while, you know, kind of doing that with the steel on the base, it's like, you know, that's just further fortification, you know. Get this looking aesthetically pleasing, and and you know, just just have a nice, uh, gorgeous little base. Uh, whoop, we'll just there we go. We'll just do that, and I think the base will look really nice. I'm liking the look of the uh, having the the ramps up up there. You know, it's like uh, looking really nice. So. <laughs> you know, it's just kind of one of those, it's like, uh, it's a, it's just something to keep it going. Ah, <laughs> uh, nope, hello there. <laughs> um, yeah, I just want to do a nice little bit of, little bit of, uh, just aesthetic base building. Just make it look pretty. Uh, so, you're wondering how I'm going to do windows real quick. We just go run right here. We just do wood windows, and they cost eight wood apiece. It's, it's kind of surprising. Um, we'll do like 30 windows. And... There we go. These, these just kind of make... Yeah, the the windows aren't the best. It's like it's at least something, you know. Just makes it look a little bit better. We'll even do some lighting upgrades in here, just just for the sake of it. Um, try to get this put in. There you go. Install all these windows and oh oh wow. Ah, uh, we'll. We'll quickly just yank out the chemistry stations just to get this base aesthetic looking nice. Simple old modifications. And lighting, really, I'm just planning on having torches. Just, just basic old torches. So. And... So we need about 20 windows per side. We'll just do another. We'll do another 10. Just simple aesthetics. Got to add a little bit of form to the function. And all right, slap you together, and we'll put the chemistry stations back down. Just a second. Uh, install that. And there you go. And yeah, wonderful, wonderful stuff. We got our we got our windows installed, and 
chemistry stations to uh, go back down and don't know why it was wanting me to place that there but yeah yeah wonderful wonderful and the candles will uh, I mean torches will do real quick um so to think here we got we got we need cloth fragments and animal fat and there we go torches we will do we'll do like 16 of them just to make them just a it'll kind of get the space looking lively and and hopefully make it look gorgeous uh make sure the poles are upgraded here really quick you'll see just how much this upgrades the just kind of gets it looking so look at that that's not the most lighting ever but it will it will certainly help they might generate heat but at this point I got so many screamers rolling in who really cares and there you go beautiful just the and we'll even just go up here, you know, just make sure everything has more torches, you know, just... There. I'm really liking how this is turning out. And... I mean, we can always make more, so... Make a whole, just make a whole load of torches, guys. Sometimes you just gotta enjoy the little things. And there we go. And I think, yep, we got that. Lovely, lovely stuff. Now, now the space is looking. Now the space is looking really, really lit up. So, and just get to order a little torch for you. Take care of you, and got that. Got that support all done. We got all the. We'll just make sure all the supports are covered up and covered up in torches, yo. Yeah. And yeah. make sure that's all don't want to waste too much resources but lovely stuff we'll see how that we'll see how that looks just jump out of the base yep get get come on there we go yeah that that's actually looking that I actually like the look of that pretty nice uh, pretty nice it's finally lit up and keep in mind I'm, I don't even have my helmet all eye on um, yeah, like, aside from some, you know, a little bit of, a little bit of, uh, builders, you know, you know, just kind of like, we have a little bit of stuff to do there, we gotta do, I just need to install a wood, wedge tip, yep, there's that, there we go. You know, just basic little repairs, you know. Ah, I'm so happy that, you know, at least you know, we got some aesthetics in here, hmm, folks. And... There we go. I just want to make sure this is all just kind of solidified again. We'll just install that. We'll just make sure that's upgraded. Yeah, just just basic little things, you know, that I've been meaning to do around here. Forgot to do my farming, but we're not. I could do that real quick, uh, you know, off camera. But speaking of which, I'm gonna you know, just kind of continue to hang out here with uh, on the you know, just kind of check, make sure everything's all 
have to scratch, you know, make sure everything's just looking, looking at, looking at its best, yo. Know. And I will catch up with you once it's nighttime, YouTube. Well, YouTube, um, working on more steel, got the farm replanted, and, well, you will let you know, a, a screamer. Um, we got a hornet, and... Spire zombie. We'll take care of the, the hornet here. Looks like, almost looks like you're coming in for a land there, buddy. I definitely, you definitely are now. 44 Magnum will do that to you. Yeah, uh, we'll harvest him up for... For his... Uh, a little bit of... Oh! Well, I was, but... Take care of Spider Boy there. Sir, I would greatly appreciate it if you stop. Thank you. And... Another Screamer's showing up. And... Take care of you. Guess we get more spires showing up. Come on. You're gonna be like this. Come on. Go away. Gotta be careful of those guys because uh, they will really take your legs out. What are you doing pointing them on my base? I ain't hoarding that yet. Come on. Come on. There you go. And, you know, just taking care of the zombies here, and... And, you know, just taking care of them all. So that's... so yeah. Getting come up on night time now. We'll just check on the steel real quick. And... Uh, that one's already done. We will get the... I think we have, we now have all the steel required for this to get done and upgrading, so... Yeah! The steel is all done, we've gotten, I've gotten basically all the, well, most of the spire, uh, spire zombie protection in. Got to, you know, got windows installed on the, on the top, on the second floor of the base, and you got the railings installed. Really happy with this progress. You know, beautiful, beautiful progress, you know, nice looking base now. And I'm really happy with this, folks, so... I'm gonna leave this episode here. If you uh, made this far and you like uh, what you see, please uh, leave a like, comment down, and subscribe below, and that will help the channel so much. Uh, have a great day, and take care.